We made it. We made what it. A day. The hardest day is over. 11 days today, five days. Five, I mean, 11 hours. I can't even speak. 11 hours today, five hours tomorrow. Wake up time. We just got a coca tea delivered to us in our tent. That's not tea. <laughs> <laughs> Time to start the day. No clouds. In the rainy season. We're lucky. Look at that. That is just spectacular. Tea? No, we don't. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you. And pancakes. And pancakes. <laughs> Just throw the pole. <laughs> so we are going to do the second day one more time with positive mental attitudes. And the most important thing, always enjoying. Okay? Okay, one, two, three. So far, so good. Gracias. I'm just like the hardest day yet. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> we are using already the original trail, okay? Yeah. The original one. Primary. That's why there are a lot of steps, right? Because the Mother Earth is also a living being, all right? Feels us, all right? It's feeling all the uh, humankind in general. The Incas built all of these steps. Getting there. Almost to the first peak of today. And this is our view. Absolutely incredible. Look at this baby. It's okay. So that's a llama, right? That's a llama. That's what the llamas eat. We're crossing the mountain pass all the llamas love a stroke. And they should eat a stroke. Yeah, I decided that the name of our group should be Team Amazing. <laughs> okay, one, two, three. Everybody say Team Amazing! Team Amazing! Well done, amigos. Good job. Congratulations. You are the best. Gracias. Hola. Gracias. Gracias. Hola. Hola. Hello. 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 Thank. Vámonos. Gracias. Okay. Muchas gracias. So we're going this way, curving that way, go over this fake pass to see the real pass. What do you think, babe? Beautiful, but tough. Then five or six steps more. Totally. Doing great. You can definitely tell there's a lack of oxygen at this high altitude. Say bye to the camera. Ciao. See you at the top. We're almost there, it's right there. We made it. And now, our ritual offering. Our stone. Here. All of our stones are here. Uh -oh. So that's the oldest uh, current, the oldest pile of the stone here in the mountain pass. Wow. So it means that some of them are very old. As I told you, your stones contains all your sacrifice, your efforts, but also your desires, your hopes. Hopes and desires. Exactly. We just made it to Dead Woman's Pass and we're able to see on both sides the mountain valley, which is really incredible. It's absolutely beautiful. Our guide has told us numerous 
numerous times how lucky we are because there's only speckled clouds. It's not um, usually, he said, it's totally foggy. Six days ago, he said it was raining and hailing by the time they got to this point. So we're very lucky that it's clear. Uh, we're taking like a five minute break to drink some coca tea, to have some snacks, and then we have about an hour and a half to two hours downhill to lunch. And we are going all the way over that mountain today. We sleep on the other side of that. So we go down, eat, rest, and then go up and then go down. Yeah. We have some passion fruit as a snack. And so you punch a hole in it and then punch through the white part. And there's these like slimy seeds inside. That's what we're eating. So here you go. And I'll just scoop it out. Very refreshing. <laughs> the one thing that I didn't know before we started this track was that the Incan Trail, Incan Trek, is a paved track that they used, that the Incans paved and used to connect the empire, or the Quechuans used to connect the empire. So here's an example of the steps. As you can see, you know, it's paved, it's not completely flat, but it's pretty well paved. And our guide told us that the reason why there's so many rocks and so many steps is mainly for the rain. So it stops a lot of the water flow. Otherwise, it would probably just all wash away. Yeah, it prevents erosion. Yeah, so it's cool. It's very interesting. I think, I think it makes it like easier and then also kind of harder because you have to watch your step on the rocks. But then also you have a rock, you know, a solid foot just to put your foot on. So, almost. Welcome drinks. You deserve it. Taquitos. Mm. Creamy soup and the garlic bread. Avocado, steak, pasta salad, quinoa, tortilla, tortilla. Tortilla, queen, avocado, quinoa. The aftermath of lunch. Quick nap before we hike up there. Just made it to the top of the second peak, and the fog is rolled in. It's like kind of like eerie, like we're up within within the fog, can't see anything. Yeah, it's pretty pretty cool. Yeah, it was easier than the morning hike, I think. Definitely. Yeah. Now we have two hours left until we're done for the day. Yeah. Great job. Yeah. Well, good job. Thank you. Job. Thank you. Well this is so cool. Oh my gosh. You come out of the tunnel and you have a pretty stellar view.
We made it to another archaeological site. We just made our way to an archaeological site, and this was an old barracks. It's it was huge. Um, it was optional, so we had to do an extra set of stairs to get here, but it was worth it. Now we have about 30 minutes left to go to camp. Camp. We just completed the longest day. Ciao. They're hungry. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Giselle, Gordon, up! Oh, another one's coming. Hey, hey, what is that? Teddy, can we pat kangaroo? Can we pat Yes, go for it. Really? Yeah, it's very friendly. This llama is used to the tourists. Oh. Okay. Well done, everybody. Good job. Oh, it's my good tail too. Oh, hey! <laughs> wow, we have. We have another one coming at us. We're very lucky. Oh, whoa! <laughs> this company is a local company and the owner, right, Raul, yeah, he used to be a porter. It's a tradition to introduce the team to the group. Yeah, because as I, as I told you, without them, right, would be not impossible, but would be challenging to do the classic Inca Trail, you know? And the idea to introduce you, right, to your team and also to introduce yourselves, right, is to make you feel that you are in a, in a nice environment, all right? That you are traveling with a family. Baba City time. Rice, veggies, chicken, potato cake, and stuffed peppers. He's crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. yeah, because don't forget that you are in your vacation. I always thought if I had a yard, it'd be nice to have it like animals eat the grass yeah. and not have to mow. That's true. Get some sheep. Yeah. And just instead of mowing, pick up the droppings. Yeah. Use that for manure for yeah, something. There you know. go. Yeah, you can use Got it. Archipelago archipelagical site. Anthropo is it anthropological or archipelago? Right there is the anthropological site we were just at. So, archaeological. Oh my. Both Westfields. Okay, Rose. Getting into our Airbnb for the night. <laughs> Very luxurious. Got a green theme. Great view of the bathroom, but wait. There's more. Oh yeah. That's the There's more. One more.
Morris is still coming, okay? But we are going to start. I think he went to the house of the meditation. Oh. Yeah. the toilet. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I will say pisco and you're gonna say sour, okay? Everybody look at here and say pisco sour. Great. <laughs>